Jamal Blackman, welcome to Huddersfield Town. You've signed a deal with the club until the end of the season. How are you feeling now you've dotted the I's and crossed the T's? Yeah, really happy. I'm really looking forward to getting out there and helping the team and obviously uh, bringing whatever experience I've, I've had along with me. You've travelled that well-trodden path from Hollywood to Huddersfield. Um, having spent some time at Canal Side training with the lads behind the scenes, how's your time at town been so far? Yeah, really good. Um, everyone's been really welcoming. I've uh, been lucky enough to work with um, Carlos before, so everyone's been really good with me and it's been a good integration with everyone and looking forward to it. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure you've set your own goals having joined and, and want to give you know, Lee Nichols some competitions for his starting place. What's it been like training alongside him and, and head of goalkeeping, Paul Clements? Yeah, it's been, been great. Uh, Paul's been really welcoming. Uh, loving the training sessions as well and obviously getting back out there and obviously training with Lee has been really good for me obviously watching him and learning as well that's, that's the good thing about goalkeepers you can always learn new things You, you touched on the, the time you spent with Carlos previously has that been e easier to, to get used to as well having worked with him before? Yeah, it's been, been really good Like straight away easy to talk to been able to see his vision and see what he wants to do with his club and I, I'm quite happy to join and obviously be a part of that Having spent nine years at Chelsea before moving to Los Angeles last year, uh, with a few loan moves in between, this is only your third permanent club of your career. What was it about the project here at town that made you want to join? Um, just seeing how, how well everyone is, it's quite like a family-based team as well, so it looked like everyone was in together and the way that they're going forward, obviously uh, being in the Premiership, seeing how well they did and obviously saying that they want to get back up there. It just showed that I wanted to be a part of that and obviously help and bring whatever I could to it. You've spent some time in the dressing room, as we say. The, the lads been good with you? Yeah, everyone's been really welcoming. I've played against a few of the lads when I was on previous loans as well, so it's been quite good. Yeah, you, you said earlier that the Championship's a division you know all about and, and know all too well from your time out on loan. The first half of the season's been really promising for town. Do you think your experience will, will help in the dressing room as we get towards that business end of the season? Yeah, I'd like to say that being a part of obviously a, a team like Huddersfield and obviously coming here and playing in the championship before, um, I've, I think with my experience being able to help the team and just to put in little parts here where I can and just being a part of that. For the uh, town fans that haven't seen you play before, can you give them an idea of what to expect from yourself if you, you are called up to glove up and get between the sticks? Um, I'd, I'd say I'm quite, quite chilled, laid back. Um, Obviously, we'll, we'll always give out 100% and try and do my best and just the easy going guy. Perfect. Jamal, thank you for your time. Congratulations again on the move and welcome to the club.